available to tape for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Buddy out of Hollywood, California, Russia. And now the his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go, go down go. right now. Fighting out of the southpaw stance. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. All right, the first round is underway here. You gotta watch out for this fighter's powerful overhand punches can do damage from both sides. And even when fighters know what's coming, oftentimes they are unable to stop it. Nice hammer fist. And he's up. A little bit uneventful. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. He's inside control here. He's trying to take the back here. He landed a huge barrage of strikes all night long and finally got to TKO. Yeah, that's a good stoppage there, Joe. The fighter stopped defending himself. He certainly wasn't intelligently defending himself, even though he was trying to keep himself in the fight. And again, the winner here was so aggressive with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality. So if you're the referee, you got to protect the fighter. And I thought he did a good job of doing just that. And here's where the ref called it.
The decision is inside the octagon. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest. At two minutes, ten seconds in the very first round. To play the winner by TKO Russia. Well, you can be sure the celebration will continue deep into the night after this TKO victory here tonight. He told us before the fight he wanted to leave the judges out of it, and that is exactly what he did. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there is nothing that's going to stop this young man from partying here tonight after the monumental TKO victory turned